I'm Lottie from Clifftop Projects and today we are going to be talking about wrapping paper. So did you know that each year in the UK we use 227,000 miles of wrapping paper? That's enough to wrap around the centre of the earth 10 times. And that's just in the UK, so imagine how much we're using across the whole world. So in today's video we're going to look at some alternatives you can use to wrapping paper, so ways you can still wrap your presents to look fun and hide what they are but without creating a load of waste, and we're going to look at if you do get wrapping paper for Christmas what you can do to reuse it so that it doesn't end up in landfill. All right let's get going. So when we're thinking about alternatives to wrapping paper we don't need to look any further than our own home especially if you are wrapping presents for other people in your house or who you know you're going to see again because they can give you the things back. <laughs> so the first thing that I've been looking at using is scarves. So you could buy some scarves that are your like special Christmas wrapping scarves and you use them again every year or you could use scarves that you've already got lying around um, and I've got these nice colourful ones that I'm going to use. You could also use pillowcases. Now, mine isn't a very interesting pillowcase, but if you've got some nice festive pillowcases or ones in Christmassy colours, they can work really well. And you can either use them to wrap the gift in or put the gift inside. Um, so pillowcases are incredibly useful to use. And my final suggestion is that you can use a tote bag. So I have my own branded ones here, but you can use any tote bag. Uh, and this means it's kind of a two gifts in one because they're also getting a bag as well as the gift inside it. We also want to make sure we're not using too much sellotape. So instead of sellotape, I recommend that you use ribbon. So you just tie up the present when you're finished, or you can use wool. And then again, that wool can be given back to you or used again. Or you can even just use like a hair tie or a shoelace just find creative ways to wrap up the, the gifts. So if you're maybe packaging up some trainers, using shoelaces as the ribbon to tie around the box could be quite funny. <laughs> so find things within your house that you think you can use. And if you're thinking, I've got a big present to give my kid, it's a bike, how am I gonna do that? I recommend using a sheet. So it's Boxing Day and maybe you were fantastic at wrapping your things in reusable things but you've still ended up with a load of wrapping paper from other people. So what are you going to do with it? You might think you can recycle it but lots of wrapping paper, especially if it's got this shiny stuff on, isn't able to be recycled. So instead of it going straight into landfill, let's have a think about some things you could do with the wrapping paper to give it another life. The most obvious thing to do with wrapping paper you've received is save it and use it as wrapping paper again next year. In my house, we've got a gift bag that we put all of our wrapping paper into after Christmas and then we can use it again the following year. If you've got an old, boring notebook, you can use some of the wrapping paper to cover it. All you need to do is cut it to the right size and then glue down the tabs on the inside. And voila, it's like you've got a brand new notepad. If you're looking for a fun activity to do between Christmas and New Year, you can always make the wrapping paper into bunting. You need to cut it into triangles 
and then hole punch some holes in the top, thread some ribbon through, and you've got a beautiful new Christmas decoration for next year. You can cut the paper into rectangles and make thank you cards for the people who gave you that present. Thanks for watching our video all about wrapping and wrapping paper. So I hope we've given you a few little ideas and I look forward to seeing some photos of how you get creative with how you're going to wrap your gifts this year and what you're going to do with that leftover wrapping paper to save it going in the bin. So have a great Christmas everyone and I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye! I think they are a bit jingly aren't they? <laughs>